This is a risky experiment, as unconsciousness can occur quite suddenly. That was a sudden change. And this is what we call a repetitive pressure. Just recover, so... And tell me what you're experiencing. A little bit giddy. Okay. Yeah, a little bit lightheaded. Physiologist Dr. Hans Wittenberg is monitoring Michael's condition by asking him to complete basic tasks. Can you show me by sticking up your fingers how much 9 minus 5 is? 9 minus 5 would be 4. Excellent. What card is this? That's the 8 of clubs. Excellent. Yeah. Michael's brain is suffering from oxygen starvation, making him feel drunk, euphoric, and overconfident. Can you hold this up for me? I can hold it up, yeah. And can you put the shape in it as well? All right, I'm looking for... I was looking for... Um, mm -hmm. I can't see... that one. I see it. I see it. Okay. Excellent. What kind of card is this? It's the three of diamonds. Three of diamonds? Yeah. I've got another shape to do. Can you put it in? Yes, it's the star. Yes. Michael will eventually face an ultimate test. Will he be able to switch his oxygen back on and save his life? Or will he be too far gone to care? How much is 8 minus 3? 8 minus 3 is 4. Is it 4? 8 minus 3. Uh, 8 minus 3 is... Michael is dangerously hypoxic. Okay, I think it's time to recover, Michael. Can you put up the switches? 6 minutes. Put up the switches. We will die. Just swing the mask back on. He's experiencing what appears to be the perfect method of execution, and he doesn't care. Put up the switches, we will die. Put up the switches. Can you tell me how you feel now? How do you feel? I feel much better. Very good. How much is eight minus three? Five, definitely, five. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, thank you. Michael. Where are we now, Captain? Well, actually, you are descending now to sea level again. We are at uh, 26,000 feet. How much longer until I would have been unconscious? Well, a matter of seconds. Right. I guess 10 to 20 seconds, and then... And from there to death? That's your final destination, then. If Hans hadn't stepped in then... He saved your life today. Okay. Be very thankful. But overall, Michael, was it painful? No. I thought the experiment was a failure because I was getting all the answers right. <laughs> Can I get all the answers right? Uh, in the end, no. Really? Yeah. I thought I was doing really well. Uh, yeah. I thought I'd outwitted you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I certainly felt so confident. Obviously I did, but that's evidently one of the symptoms of hypoxia. And I had no idea that I was near death. You know, I was just, yeah, I was very happy, very happy. Hell of a way to go. Hell of a way to go.